back with the up down report. 82 burning questions. Play along on Twitter, hashtag the starters, thumbs up or thumbs down. Question 30 overall, guys, is LeBron still the best basketball player in the NBA? Yeah. Everybody yeah. says yes. Yeah. Everybody says yes. You it's... all took Kevin Durant, though, for MVP. Mm -hmm. But you that still. That doesn't matter. I, I'm saying, I'm just clarifying here, but still LeBron, in your eyes, the best in the league. Yeah, I don't know how you, you take this away from him. He was working out three days after the NBA Finals. Mm. He still feels good in that 32-year-old body. He was a bald head nut working out. <laughs> uh, he's still the guy. I, I don't. I don't get any sort of idea of taking it away from him. I think it's pretty close, though, when you throw in guys like Kawhi and Kevin Durant, because they're all incredible players. But what separates LeBron for me is his versatility, that he can basically play point guard, shooting guard, small forward power, wherever he wants to play, and on the defensive end as well. And if you were to pick one player to start your franchise with, like taking out all those factors of age and where he's in his career, I think you would still pick LeBron out of every, anyone else in the league. Oh, yeah. You're still picking him first in a pickup game. The 2016 finals wasn't very long ago when he had maybe the best three finals games ever right in a row. Mm. He averaged a triple-double in the finals last year, which yeah. I had completely forgot about until I went back. Like, oh, yeah, LeBron, he's still really good. Mm -hmm. The difference is that the gap now between him and Kevin Durant – is very thin. It's Brandon Ingram thin. Um, <laughs> yeah. But he, there's just more margin of error for Durant and the Warriors, you know, so Durant doesn't quite have to do as much, which is kind of what LeBron does during the regular season. It's just the Cavs struggle for it because he's not doing this.